Hi friends, welcome back. In previous video, we have seen some annotations like at the rate getter, at the rate setter, at the rate equals and hash code, at the rate data. So similarly, we have few more annotations in the Lombok that is at the rate no arg constructor and at the rate all arg constructor. Now suppose, let us see at the rate no arg constructor. Now. When we add that constructor, we can see that no arg constructor got generated for our model class. Now, anyhow, that default constructor will be generated by our Java compiler. We can verify that by using Java profiler, Java p command. But that is not that much important because uh, anyhow, default constructor will be generated. Suppose, let us think about, I want to write a constructor for my class with all these variables. That means we need to write a parameterized constructor for all these variables. Now, so generally, how can we write that? We can go for right click, source, generate, constructor using fields. These are all the fields that I want to use in my parameterized constructor. Now, click on generate. So, see here, now we are able to generate parameterized constructor with all the fields of our class. Now, almost 10 to 20 lines of code got added here. Instead of we are writing this constructor, we can use one annotation provided by Longbox that is at the rate all arcs constructor. Now, now you can guess what is the meaning of this all arcs constructor, which is used to generate a constructor with all the variables for our model class. Now, you can see here in the outline plan info integer string string date date string double these are all the variables that added to our parameterized constructor now is it really added we can validate that go to my app class try to create the object for our model class plan info info is equal to new plan info now you can observe that now we have a constructor with all these fields so we can generate a parameterized constructor for our model class by using annotation called at the rate all arcs constructor. Now, when parameterized constructor is added for our class, default constructor will not be added by Java compiler. Now, suppose I want default constructor as well as parameterized constructor for my model class. Then you can go for at the rate no arcs constructor. Now, First constructor is used to generate parameter as a constructor with all the fields for the model. Second annotation is used to generate default constructor for the model. Now we can validate that in our plan info outline. Here you can see zero param constructor is added. That is no arcs constructor and all arcs constructor is also added for this one. So I hope you understood how to generate no arcs constructor and parameter constructor for our model classes by using project Lombok. Thank you.